Hey everyone, it's springtime, uh, so it's time to take the solar panel and the battery out of storage. Uh, we weren't using it for, during the winter, so I figured this would be a good opportunity to show you guys how I install it. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to put the battery inside the trunk uh, where I keep it, and we'll plug in the cables to the battery and to the charge controller. So the first step will be to connect the uh, wires to the positive and negative um, poles of the battery. And it's important to make sure that the other ends of these wires are not touching, otherwise you're going to short your battery. So I've made sure of that already. So now it's time to attach our wires to the battery. Before going forward, be sure to always follow your product's installation instructions. And we're connecting red to positive, black to negative. So the charge controller comes with uh, little screws with little plates behind them like this. So I kind of formed the wires to fit around that screw. Kind of like a little loop. Close it in. And again, we're connecting red to positive, black to negative. Same thing with the black one. I flipped the solar panel over as you can see and these are the two wires that come with it and since it's sunny out uh, we want to make sure that these wires won't touch accidentally so I just wrapped one of them uh, with some electrical tape. So these uh, Z shaped brackets here they came with the solar panel so uh, they also came with these bolts here so I just bolted these on uh, like so and now I'm going to install my additional brackets that allow me to connect it to the roof. So I want to keep some slack on these for now. I'll show you guys why later. So now that we have it on the roof, we can just spin these things around and hug the rails in each one. And then we put the bolts on the other side. Keep these a little bit loose until we do the other side. And now we can go ahead and tighten all the bolts. Next I'll just pass the wires under this. And then I'm going to pass them through the water barrier of the door here. I made a small hole. I'll come back after I install all the cables to fill this hole with some sealant. Final step is to just attach these wires to the charge controller itself. And as always, connect black to the negative, red to the positive. And there we go. Now we can see that the solar panel is charging the battery, so it's ready to use.